we're now going to copy this portal. So I've highlighted all of it in the 3D view to make sure I get the connections as well. I'm then going to select the copy command. And I'm just going to very carefully make sure that I keep this level as I copy it across from grid line to grid line. Be careful not to go at a funny angle. There we go. All right, then. I'm not doing the two by there deliberately at the moment because I want to modify this end one. I want to put a intermediate floor. So I'm going to go to the first floor level and then I'm going to go to the structure beam. I'll save the project in a bit and just add some beams going from intersection to intersection. Make sure the placement plane, first floor, OK. There we go, intersection to intersection. And repeat. And then repeat one more time again. And we'll go actually, rather than going to there, I'm going to stop at the column. Okay, and I will also just swing over to this side. That's fine there. Let's look at that in 3D. So we can spin it around. There we go. We've now got some beams going across. We need a couple of columns as well. Back to our ground floor column. Use the ones we've already got. Um, height, don't want them up to the roof, only first floor. And the depth. Foundation, that's fine. At the intersection, by there. And by there. Yeah, that one. I should have done that the other way around. OK, click on that and just change the height to first floor. That one, change the base to foundation. So that's sorted those out. Okay, next we want to put our pads on them, so we'll get that done quickly. Structure. There we go. There we go, getting that carefully at the intersections. Let's put the connection base plates. like we did in the previous video. OK, there's our base plates. Next, we want our connections between that and the beam by there. So steel connection. Now, obviously, we don't want the connection that it's automatically loading in there. That's not what we want. So we can look at a few different options. Um, we have beam T seats by there. OK, so let's have a little look at that. That gives us a little tiny seat and a bolt. Um, I'm going to find something a bit different to that. Don't need a skewed angle clip angle. Let's have a look at that. So that looks a little bit better. OK, that on both sides. OK, so I'm going to go for that. And then this one and this one. And again, you would obviously find the appropriate connections for whatever it is you're doing. There we go. Let's find uh, the platform on this one. Uh, 
Um, so that is one option, like that. Uh, not a big fan. So I'm just going to swap that over to that one, like that. And then I'll do the same with these ones. Platform plate again, and then finally do the same on that one. And again, with these connections, you can modify them as you can with any of the others. So now I just want to highlight that one in its entirety, go back to my ground floor, and zoom out a bit. Press the copy command and we'll go from there, keeping it level to there and then to there. OK, and that gives us the basic frame of the building.